Good morning, everybody. Firstly, sorry for not signing out last night. Completely forgot. Um, we got home, we packed a bit. We went on our phones, we went to bed. That's pretty much it. Um, yeah, and now we're up. We've had a lying. So bus is until 12, which is really good. We're just about to go down for breakfast, but we're a bit worried. Because there's been a power cut here. And there's still loads of power cut. Sorry, we just woken up. Um, yeah, so we're hoping we still get our breakfast. But we'll have to see. Worrying times. <laughs> bye bye, room. This, oh, <laughs> my bag just dropped. The smallest double room, no, triple room of all time. But it's quite cute. <laughs> You can just see the lake in the distance there. Hello again everyone. We're in Lune. Oh wow, that sunset's really pretty. You just think, see the pink behind that tree. Um, which is really, really nice so far. We've got a really nice, like, really clean, fresh room um, with really nice beds and um, the towels were in little swans when we came in, which was really nice. And we just found somewhere up the road which does really cheap food. So we've all got spring rolls, eight for under a pound. And she's told us to mix these three sauces together, which is chili, soy, and tomato, ketchup, yeah. And we've got two fried rices and one fried noodles coming later. So we've just had a wander up the road in a power cut, which was very odd. And we stumbled upon these packs. Literally, they were there and we had to eat them. Um, we had no choice in the matter. Fifi went for banana. Jess has gone for lemon and sugar with chocolate. Very odd. Tom's got a coconut shake, which is already finished. Oh, how is it? Good. Good. Good morning, everybody. Woo -hoo, woo -hoo. We are on the beach in Mune, finally, which is really nice. And today, we're trying to get rid of some tan lines. Well, I am anyway, because I've got these horrible, horrible finger marks on my leg from uh, not trying, so I'm trying to get rid of them. Chilled day and then sand dunes, plant some sand dunes for tomorrow. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. Wow. Thank you. Wow. We Good morning, everybody. Okay, everyone's making fun of me now. Aren't you funny? Um, we're just having a drink before we go to bed. Had some really nice. Well, dinner wasn't really actually nice? that. Yeah, I'd say dinner wasn't actually that nice. Really cool. Spring rolls that I showed you were good. Yeah, I had a meat one. Oh yeah, I had a meat one. <sighs> really gross. A curry was really flavourless, and your pork noodles were weird. No Our pork, we'd... not much pork, a bit bony. Yeah. That's got the wrong drink. You got the wrong drink. I didn't get a beer. <laughs> Oh yeah, they didn't charge us for that though, did they? So it's all good. Anyway, and it's true. We've come for a stroll down the road for a drink for bed. We're gonna have dessert. I've had a cool netto, but we're not really, we're fine. So I've had, got my lemon juice finally, because I ordered one in the last place and got pineapple instead. Got a hot Milo for Fifi and a beer finally for Tom. So we're all set. Um, and I am making sure that I sign out tonight because I've forgotten the last two nights. So we will see you tomorrow for a day of sand dunes and beaching. Um, yeah. Would anyone like to sign out? Good night. Good night. We forgot the number one rule, which is someone should always be looking at it. Looking for? Has anyone left any food in this room? Never <laughs> so it's nearly midnight and we have discovered an almighty cockroach in our room. The biggest cockroach I've ever seen, and I've seen a lot of cockroaches from when I lived in Thailand. Um, oh. 
Tommy's gonna try and kill it. Is there someone there? Mm -hmm. Can she help? Well, she Tell her to come and look. <laughs> I think she's gonna come and help. There it is, creeping across the ceiling. <laughs> it's really near my bed. The lady just came in to, oh my God, it's huge. <laughs> okay, Tom, shoe time. No, I'm gonna wait until, in, in, in case she brings in someone else to do the shoe. Better dead cockroach on the bed than the live one. Oh my god. Oh no, it's gone. Where is it? <laughs> oh, there, there. In the window. Do you want to point it? Oh my god. The woman just grabbed the cockroach in her hand. God, I've got the actual shiver my timbers from that. Oh, and she just so take it outside. She's amazing. Can I can't I believe it. <laughs> yeah, of course you can. <laughs> Literally, did you just look outside and she was just there? I was thinking, yeah, maybe I have to open the door and then if it flies, we can like... But why was she just outside? What was she doing? Anything? Do you think we were being just, loud? No, it's just good timing. We were even really being loud. It was good timing. Okay. I'm going to my hair, right?